Well, they are on the rise and they are on the attack. We're talking about gypsy moths. They're insects with a big appetite for trees during the summer. News 8's Donovan Long shows us how to get rid of them. A year ago, groundskeepers at the Pilgrim Home Cemetery noticed caterpillars were destroying their European beech trees like these. The outbreak was bad, and the culprit, insects known as gypsy moths. Upon further inspection, we noticed we had caterpillars, gypsy moths, all over the place. The insects were on the attack, defoliating several trees in this cemetery a year ago. They just munch away on all the leaves, and pretty soon there's no leaves left. Workers say they acted quickly then and are still on guard today, calling on tree experts to spray for gypsy moths about three weeks ago. Over the course of a few days, caterpillars rained down from the skies, and they exited the trees. and. Um, we did another treatment this spring uh, just to get the ones we missed from last year. Experts say gypsy moth outbreaks happen every seven to ten years. They say the caterpillars feed on the tree leaves from the spring until the end of July. Outbreaks are on the rise right now. We're getting reports now of uh, Wyoming, Byron Center, uh, Caledonia, Gun Lake, uh, Kalamazoo, and some of the Lakeshore areas. The list goes on. Arbor is saying the insects can possibly kill the trees they're attacking and even spread to neighboring trees that aren't even their intended target. It tends to be a neighborhood problem, not this owner and that owner a mile away. It tends to be a, a, a neighborhood issue. It's an issue cemetery groundskeepers aren't expecting to reemerge. You can see behind me and around me, the trees look beautiful. And an issue they want you to tackle very quickly. Experts urging anyone who may have a problem with gypsy moths to call an arborist immediately. They say if the problem goes untreated, the trees will suffer. Reporting in Holland, Donovan Long, News 8.